Hi there, everybody. Today, we're talking about butterflies and how they taste. Now, when we think about humans and how we taste, we have taste buds on our tongues, right? Right here. However, butterflies, they don't have tongues. Their mouth parts are actually called a proboscis, and it's a tube-like structure where they use it basically as a straw to suck up all sorts of different fluids, whether that be nectar, rotting fruit juices, even wet poop. They feed on mostly wet things. Now, while they do have some taste receptors here on their mouth part and also on their antenna, the concentration of their um, taste receptors are actually on their feet. Now, what a weird place to be able to taste things. There's a very good reason for it though, especially for the female butterflies. As we know, butterflies lay eggs on very special plants called their host plants. And each type of butterfly has their own kind of host plant. Now imagine you're a butterfly and you're flying around from plant to plant, and the best way to tell your host plant is by tasting it. It takes a lot of extra energy to be able to bend over and chew or lick to decide if that is the correct host plant. So instead, these taste receptors are on their feet so they can just fly from plant to plant, just land, and they don't have to bend over. Now, males also have taste receptors on their feet, and so both male and female use that to determine whether a food is a good food source. So they do taste a little bit before they stick their face in and start drinking stuff. So anyways, that is today's fact bit.